This one's just going to be a little short one about a two-year-old bucket out in the bush. Buried it out there, well, semi-buried for a couple years now. I want to check it out, see how everything is inside. See if it, uh, like some is vacuum sealed, some is in mylar bags. Let's see how uh, everything held up. Uh, being semi-buried, uh, it really was exposed to a lot of elements, had snow on it, different stuff. Um, let's see how it all is. So here we are just cruising into the bush. I don't know if I mentioned, thanks for stopping in. Uh, here we are right at the stump here. We're just going to uh, grab it out of the, the stump. Kind of buried a little bit in there, covered up with stuff. Not a, not a real hidden thing, you might say. So here we are going to grab it out, have a look inside. It is in a contractor's bag. And we'll see when it comes up here that it uh, got a little bit of leaks in it. Uh, but it's in a five gallon bucket with a gamma seal lid. So we're hoping everything inside is good. So just a little bit of us showing us heading out there doing it. It was a beautiful day. And uh, as, we, as we get her all ripped open and looked at, we see that definitely the water had gotten through. Uh, it's like a three mil contractor's bag, but it's kind of just like for extra protection. And the water had gotten inside and on the, on the lid itself, as you can see coming up here. But it wasn't a big deal, because uh, once we got it open, everything was good. So what we wanted to do was just uh, have a quick look out there with it and then bring it into town and see how it all fared. This bucket was number four, had it all listed, what was inside, so... having a look now back at base central checking everything out so you'll see here we'll go through it all and then what I'm going to do is uh, maybe just uh, take the flour there's salt and sugar and different stuff there take the flour and see how that held up try and make uh, we're gonna make end up making uh, a little bit of Let's see, yeah, we're going to make uh, some dinner rolls and a little loaf of bread. Try our hand at that. So, let's see how all that turns out. Well, here we go. We got it all made up in the pans. Looking good. We'll get her in the oven and let's cook her up. And before you know it, a stove. Here it is. Doesn't look bad at all. So, I think this has been successful. We see here you can bury it out, semi-bury it, still do it. And I haven't tested out the salt and sugar, but the flour, oh, it seems to have just, it, a little, just a little clumpy. Not bad in the bag, but really, really, it was nothing. As you can see, it's made some nice bread, and it's all good. Thanks for stopping in. Take care.